my friends welcome back again to our channel this is episode number 3 based on the msc entrance examination a complete web series presented by the wisdom tutorial now the continuation of the previous section that means we have to discuss from the question number 21 if you want to watch from question number 1 to 20 you must watch our episode 2 video from our channel okay the question number 21 is the structure of nuclear membrane helps in it is basically helps in nucleocytoplasmic exchange of the material the explanation are given here now question number 22 A trihybrid cross is made between two plants with genotype capital A small a capital B small b capital C small c. How many offsprings of such a cross will have a genotype small a slash small ab slash small bc slash c? In case of trihybrid cross, all of we know that the total number of genotypes is always sixty-four. and the homozygous recessive trait is always 1 so the correct option is 1 by 64 now question number 23 transition type of gene mutation is caused when at is replaced by gc that means purine is replaced by another purine or the pyrimidine is replaced by another pyrimidine okay now the question number 24 in a cross between individuals homozygous for small ab and wild type plus plus 700 out of 1000 individuals in f2 were of parental type distance between capital a and capital b would be so the process of this mathematics is you have to find out the recombinant frequency so the recombinant frequency in this math is 300 by 1000 into 100 that means 30% so 30% means the 30 map unit is present in between these two genes so correct option is option number 3 30 map units now question number 25 if n equals to 16 in a diploid plant how many bivalents are possible at metaphase 1 of meiosis it is a straight question the haploid number of chromosomes always represents the number of bivalents so the answer is 16 bivalents now question number 26 heterocis is it is nothing but the superiority of hybrids over their parents the question number 27 the lowest level of chromosome organization is obviously the nucleosome in chromosome packaging the primary structure is the formation of nucleosome later on the secondary structure is solenoid or zigzag model tertiary structure is radial loop quaternary structure is chromosome shape now question number 28 trickly is developed through the intergeneric hybridization of obviously wheat and rye all the explanation is is given here go through it now question number 29 which of the following has the largest number of chromosome all of we know that ophioglossum reticulum has the largest or the highest number of chromosome it has 2n equals to 1260 chromosomes in a cell or parcel now question number 30 if genes capital a and capital b are linked and separated by 14 map units the percentage of parental progeny produced from test crossing a double heterozygote will be so how do you calculate this math directly the total percentage you have to calculate this math by a simple formula the total percentage is 60% just subtract the recombinant percentage that means 14 map units that means 14% so 100% minus 14% equals to 86% question number 31 mustard gas is a obviously chemical mutagen i have given here the entire list of mutagen go through it question number 32 acl treatment preceding root tip mitosis is done for dissolving middle lamella 
all of we know that it is a very common pretreatment for the root tip of mitosis or for mitosis question number 33 chromosome staining with acetocarmine occurs due to adsorption reaction i have given here the explanation question number 34 which one is widely distributed in a cell obviously rna question number 35 a solenoid is composed of six nucleosomes per turn all of you know that that is a 30 nanometer fiber structure and six nucleosomes per turn and one nucleosome consists of five nanometer length or breadth third question number 36 which chromosome may be lost during cell division any acentric chromosome always lost during cell division so the correct option is acentric chromosome question number 37 in meiosis 1, bivalent is an association of. It is the association of two chromatids and two centromeres. This is a very simple question. I have given here the entire explanation. Go through it. Question number 38. Cytoskeleton is made up of. Obviously, proteinaceous filament. Now, question number 39. Phenotypic ratio. 7 is to 1 is to 1 is to 7 in F2 generation refers to. It is, that is nothing but the linkage phenomenon or better to say the coupling linkage phenomenon. But in case of repulsion linkage phenomenon, the ratio is just opposite 1 is to 7 is to 7 is to 1. You have to remember this thing also. Question number 40. Point mutation arises due to change in. Obviously, single base pair of DNA. Now, the question number 41 which of the following algal pigment is soluble in water it is nothing but the phycocyanin i have given here the entire list so this is all about the episode 3 if these informations are helpful for you and you like this video then you definitely subscribe our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon and share our video as much as possible otherwise you miss the upcoming video for our channel goodbye stay safe stay healthy stay positive and stay well